This is Indy Home Expert. Today, we're guiding you through common homeowner questions. It's summer, and that means spending a lot of time outdoors, usually with some uninvited guests. Did you know there are 3,000 species of mosquito? But only three kinds actually carry and transmit diseases like malaria, West Nile, and Zika viruses. Only females are capable of biting and sucking blood from people and animals, and they use that blood not for their own nourishment, but as a protein source for their eggs. Chief Mosquito Hunter Andy Fuller shares the best tips and tricks to take back your summer. Mosquitoes are a big pain. Your home is most likely the biggest investment you'll ever make in your life. But with Mosquito Hunters, we want to help you take back your yard and make the most of your home and make the most of your summer. The biggest influx of mosquitoes in this part of the country from basically the end of April until the end of September. Mosquitoes love to breed in standing water. And so it could be something large like a, a bad irrigation that's in the yard where it's a giant puddle, or it could be something as small as a bottle cap. A bottle cap filled with water is enough to create 300 mosquitoes. Eliminating that standing water is a big part of keeping the mosquito populations down. Mosquitoes are more likely to bite pregnant women. Mosquitoes are more likely to bite someone who's been drinking alcohol. For whatever reason, mosquitoes are more likely to bite someone who has type O blood. Also, carbon dioxide is the biggest attractor of mosquitoes. Either stop exhaling or start taking more aggressive methods to keep the mosquitoes away. Mosquitoes bite us for our blood, everybody knows that, but mosquitoes actually don't get energy from our blood, they get energy from the plants in your yard. So by treating the plants, we're cutting out the mosquitoes' energy source. We know that mosquitoes hate chrysanthemum flowers. We don't know why, but mosquitoes are naturally uh, very uh, opposed to getting anywhere near chrysanthemum flowers. So the product that we use has the active ingredient that's the synthetic of the chrysanthemum flower. It's called a pyrethroid. It's the same thing that's found in flea and tick shampoos that we use with our pets. It's the same thing that's found in head lice medication that we use with our kids. And it's micro-encapsulated, so that's what we're applying to the plants. It's great because the toxicity is really low, but it's also really effective at keeping the populations of mosquitoes, fleas, and ticks down. Anything that you have under the kitchen sink or anything that you have in the garage is more likely to be a lot more toxic than anything we're using. But we also have an all-natural treatment that uses active ingredients like rosemary and thyme. So for those clients that want to have strictly all-natural organic materials applied, we have an answer for them. So we can say that we're kid-friendly, pet-friendly, plant-friendly, but not mosquito-friendly. Some other good ways to keep the mosquito populations down is to avoid overwatering your plants avoid having any bird baths, avoid having overgrown lawns. Also make sure your neighbors aren't having any of those issues too. If your neighbors have overgrown grass or if they are overwatering their plants, it could be affecting the mosquitoes in your yard as well. Mosquito hunters, we believe that the only thing better than summer is a mosquito-free summer. So our treatment will reduce mosquito flea and tick populations on average by 85 to 95 percent. So the best way to have continuous coverage of keeping the mosquitoes, fleas and ticks away throughout the mosquito season throughout summer is to have applications done every 21 days. And with Mosquito Hunters, we stand behind our happiness promise, so we'll come back out within the 21-day period post-treatment with no questions asked. Mosquito Hunters helps you take back your yard, making mosquito control effective, affordable, and environmentally responsible too. Introductory treatments start at $39 for half acre or less properties. Stop the itching and start enjoying the outdoors again. It's our pleasure to help you take back your yard with Mosquito Hunters. A mosquito's average lifespan is between two weeks and six months, and humans aren't the number one feeding choice. Typically, they prefer horses, cattle, and birds. Indie Home Expert will be right back. There are many plants, herbs, and flowers that help serve as natural bug repellent. To help keep insects at bay, consider planting basil, lemongrass, or mint, marigolds, petunias, and lavender, chives, leeks, onions, and garlic. 